I'm just trying to position this character inside this space, but uh, the freaking walls and ceilings are getting in the way. What I would do is the following. Since uh, this classroom, a banner classroom, is a single mesh, I would first duplicate the whole thing. Duplicate objects. And right click to uh, not move it. I would call the new duplicate classroom original and hide it. And for this classroom, I'm gonna create a new object, add mesh cube. And now I want to make this cube uh, the size of what I want to be able to see. So I'm just gonna use scale to make it wide and uh, long, but not high. Height depends on how much of the wall you want to preserve. And now I'm just gonna go to modifiers, Modifier Properties, Add Modifier, Boolean, and select the cube here, either by selecting it here, or by using the pipette icon. Click and click. And I don't want the difference, I want the intersect. And now I'm just gonna make the cube invisible, also rename it to Out of the Way. And here we have it, we have the bottom of the level. We can still use that, we can also change it by changing the height. To see it immediately, let's go to Object Properties while the Out of the Way block is selected and make it not textured, but rather wire. Yeah, maybe this is better so we can see the tops of the tables. Now this might be a huge performance hit, depending. So I would actually go to Classroom, go to Modifiers and Apply. And when you're done, you would just delete the classroom and reinstate the classroom original. Yeah, these lines are a bit annoying. To fix it, just go to Edit Mode, go to Mesh, Clean Up, Delete Loose. At least those are gone. Yeah, let's uh, hide the out of the way box again. And now we can place the character as we like without being annoyed by the uh, annoying uh, walls and ceiling. Hope this helped. Give the video a like if it did. Let me know in the comments if it really blew your mind. I'm sure for many of you it will be a of course effect, because probably many of you already know the Boolean modifier. Enjoy editing your models. Until next time, ciao!